Hey everyone, welcome back to Raw Cards and Collectibles. Today we're going to open up some Scarlet and Violet. We've only opened a little bit so far. So we're going to crack into another ETB. Try our luck again. We didn't have the best the first time around. We're going to try again here. See if we can't get a banger hit. Wish me luck. And if you're watching, you know I appreciate it. Always nothing but love for all of my subscribers. Here we go. If you don't know what's in this, you got your little booklet right here you know a list of the set of cards Get this out here we'll put a pack to the side for now got your little energy pack here the new one really really just sick artwork on this promo card i love this card wow it's first time opening this myself code card for you there and then you have your dividers or whatever uh your dice Damage counters, I believe them are called. I never play the uh, game, for, you know, competitively. So, not big on them. Sorry, I'm just starting a new pile of uh, dice and stuff down here. I'm donated all my old ones, so. Give me one second here. All right. Oh, these and the energies. You know, we'll put these over here for now. I won't make you wait on them. One more, one more ETB stacked up. Sorry about this noisy chair. Let's get this promo open here. Hmm, not the best looking uh, so far from what I can see. Little whitening on the corners there, if you could see. Uh, not too bad, but it's a little rough. Uh, I don't know if you can see down here. Some light scratches down there or like print lines on the corner down here. But otherwise, like, look at that. Look at that artwork. That is such a beautiful card. Like, that is really a beautiful artwork. Got the moon in the background, all pink looking and, you know, the like skyscrapers and the tree or whatever. I love this promo card. Happy to get that. This I decided to open in this tube, throwing a, just a couple... You know, just a couple extra packs decided to throw in there just to mix it up for you guys. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. Little, like, pop-out. I guess they're stickers. Are they stickers? Yeah, they're stickers. Oh, huh, that's cool. I guess I'll save them for my son later. I don't think he'll like them. And then Astral Radiance and Silver Tempest. Not bad. I have not opened barely any Silver Tempest or Astral Radiance. Oh, and there's more. There you go. Get this open without damaging it. Oh, they actually put them in like a... Oh, yeah. wow. I thought it was in a sleeve for a second. Let's take a look at these real quick before we get into everything else. Galarian Slow King with a sick looking hollow pattern in the back. Really sick. Got a big print line down that one, unfortunately. And this one as well. Galarian Obstagoon. Cool looking hollow pattern though. You see that? Very, very cool. And Dragapult. Now these don't say promo on them, but I always put cards like these with the special with the special hollow patterns. Uh, I always put them with my promos in the same binder as my promo binder, you know. Print line on the obs obs ah, obstagoon a little bit up there, print line straight across. And Dragapult. No print line that I can see. The big print line. Don't know if you could see, but the big print line. There it is. Right there, you see? Okay, let's sleeve these bad boys up. I'm holding up the video long enough. Sorry, guys. Slap these back here. Call it a day. And we'll get right into it. I threw in some extra sleeve boosters this time. Never have much luck with the sleeve boosters. Uh, but we're gonna give it a whirl Let's go ahead and just rip them all open <laughs> Anybody who <laughs> doesn't click right out of the video because I haven't opened a pack and uh, You know however long I'm into this video already five six seven minutes into the video uh, If you stayed the whole time, I appreciate it Sorry, I just wanted to get that done. All right guys finally get into the packs. I'm sorry I told you this is the low-budget backyard boogie channel the misfits over here. 
Okay, I don't... I can't remember the card trick. Is it one from the back? I think they said one. Let's just do one. C, C Toddle. Magikarp. That's a cool looking Magikarp. Check that out. Magnemite. Energy Switch. Ultra Ball. S. Espathra. Arvin. Flittle Reverse. Tarant. Tarantaloo Reverse. And King. King Gambit. King Gambit. Or whatever. I don't know why I'm sleeving these hollows. I've been saying that I was going to take. Uh, Take out all of the hollows out of my binders that I've been keeping all these all this time since what was it? April, May, June, May? No, not quite May. June or July? Around June, I'd say. It's 2021. I got back into the hobby uh, after a really bad car accident. Ended up with 11 broken bones. Don't want to get into that at all of that, but <laughs> really painful. Anyways, uh, since then I've collected all my hollows. I just put them in the back of my binders usually. Uh, and keep the better stuff towards the front, you know? Ooh, Iron Treads EX. That's a really cool-looking hollow pattern. Yeah, that's really cool. I think this is just, like, a equivalent to, like, a V card. I know there's another one, a dolphin look card that's worth a little bit, but this isn't one of them. I don't, I don't, it's not that one, I don't think. That's a hit, though. You know, our last uh, Scarlet and Violet opening, I mean, we opened a ton, and... Or no, yeah, it was a ton. It was like 15, 16 packs, you know, ETB and then, a, I don't know, seven, eight, nine other sleeve booster packs and didn't get anything except for one hit, a Magnazone EX. So, already we're doing better than that, so. Rotom, Palpad, Flabebe, Toxel, Medicham, Quaxwell, Cyclizer. Starly Reverse. <gasps> oh my goodness! The banger itself! Are you kidding me? Out of a sleeved booster pack. Can you believe that? I cannot believe this just happened. Oh, tell me there's no whitening on it. Oh, and there's no whitening on it either. It's not perfect. I got really excited for a minute there, which I am excited. The best pull right there. We got the best hit out of the whole thing. Man, I was I, mean, I got really excited because the centering looks so good. And the centering is really good for a, just a random sleeve booster pack. But it's a little bit bigger over here. It, you know, it's they're always diagonal a little bit. So it's like skinnier up here. Then as it gets down, it gets a little bigger. And then on this side, you can see it's skinnier up here and then gets a little bigger down here. And then top to bottom, man, top to bottom is like spot on. And, you know, it is a little bigger on the right than the left. I'll tell you what, I might take a chance and grade this. Wow, I might take a chance and grade this, honestly. Oh, is that a print line straight down the blue edge? Oh, uh, I don't know if that would count as a print line. It's so faint, it's like so hard to see. Ah, uh, you can see it. Can you see it? Uh, it's so hard to show you, even on camera here. I mean, it's it's faint. Like, it's really hard. It's really hard to catch it. I don't know if you can catch it there. Anyway, sorry guys. Sorry to hold it up. But this is so awesome. And it's so hard to even look at the edges and the corners. Because this hollow pattern is bananas. Like, this thing is insane. This hollow pattern is one of my favorites by far, for sure. We are going to put this in a penny sleeve, and I am going to set it off to the side for now. And we will, um, we will be grading that, probably. One of the bigger hits I've gotten since, you know, opening newer sets, so we might go ahead and grade that. Sorry, I got a little fuzz going on in here. You know, if there's fuzz in the sleeve, I can't handle it. Oh my goodness, that drives me nuts. If, if you're like that, if you're the same as me and like a little bit of fuzz in a pack drives you crazy, comment down below. Sorry to hold up the video, uh, the video guys. I cannot believe we pulled the Miriam. I am, that's, that's the card I wanted the most. This is only my second Scarlet and Violet opening. And you know, that card was a couple hundred dollars. I remember when it first 
came out, but it's down a lot now, 70, 80 bucks, but it's, it's got the Pikachu in the background. I mean, the Pikachu in the background there on the, like the, man, it, it's just such a beautiful card. I'm so happy to pull that. <clears throat> Buzel, Energy Retrieval, Mouse Hold, Vitality Band, Toxicity, Stone Journer. I can never pronounce this pack. Patrisu, Patrisu, and Houndstone. Another hollow. I'm putting in a Dragon Shield sleeve. I don't know why I keep doing that. I'm so used to it, though. Maybe I'm just like, whatever. And then, this is what I mean. This is what I hate about these sleeves. Fresh out of the box, and there's always something. Always little specks of dust and stuff. Gosh, that drives me absolutely crazy. I know. You're like, come on, just open the packs already. This guy. What are you doing, Tom? <laughs> come on, Thomas, hurry up. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, man, I'm excited, though. This was a good opening. Flittle, Sea Viper, Houndour, Katoddle, Jack, Florigato, EXP Share, Metacham Reverse, and, oh my gosh, the, sorry, I know I'm not pronouncing this right, I have not even tried to pronounce this, I don't know this Pokemon that well, Coradon, or Coradon, Coradon EX, oh, and the Moradon, is it Maradon, or, hmm, Maradon, Coradon, I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing it right, but wow, look at that, and it's well-centered, Wow, we're having some crazy luck, man. I thought Scarlet and Violet was... I'm not very happy with the set, I, I gotta admit. Even though I've only opened it one other time. I don't like the the border, the, you know, the uh, silver around the borders. Like the Japanese cards. I don't like that. This card, though. And the Miriam. These are some of the better hits. Like, besides the other alt art version of this. And then the Meridon, I guess. They both have an alt art, I'm guessing. Wow, look at that. That's a beautiful gold card. And the centering is very good. You know what? The back, uh, I mean, left to right looking at it, very, very worthy of a 10. Top to bottom, worthy. But then you get to the back. What is that? Oh, there we go. You get to the back and it just looks a lot bigger on the, looks a lot bigger on the right compared to the left which means that this side you would think is bigger than this side but it's a, it's like the opposite on the front usually it's whatever it shows on the back is how it is on the front tell you what another banger it's going in the penny sleeve why not why not such a beautiful card it's worth grading to me i mean yes it's expensive to grade cards I've only picked out my very best. I passed up a lot of cards that I really would have liked to get graded and didn't because they weren't good enough. But, man, we're getting some killer luck. Come on, let's go. I was overdue, man. I really did not have uh, much luck for the last three or four openings. And, you know, as you've seen on some videos, they were pretty boring videos. I apologize. Astral Radiance. We're going to go into something different here before we open up the rest of these packs. Astral Radiance and Silver Tempest. We'll see if we can't get lucky out of these. There's a code card for you. One, two, three, four from the back, I imagine. A lot of whitening I'm seeing on the back. Energy. Hussein Heavy Ball. Purr Ugly. Uxy. Mischievous. Barboach. Scyther. Eevee. Heracross. Brazong. Nice little hit. And, ooh. High Soon, or High Soon Samurai V Star. I'm sorry, I cannot pronounce that. Nice pack. You know, one pack magic there. You know, what can you do, what can you say about that? Not great centering and the edge where, you know, you could see some whitening, you know, rough edges on them, but very happy with that. Cannot complain. I really wish I would have bought more of Astral Radiance and Silver Tempest. I completely skipped them. This card right here is perfect. Look at the front of this. Look at the centering on this. Bottom's a little heavier than the top now that I'm looking at it. But the back, I mean, it looks absolutely perfect. If this was like a bigger hitter, you know, that would be something awesome to grade too. Very happy with that. One pack magic. You can't complain when you're open one pack. And here's Silver Tempest. Come on. Lugia, right? That's Silver Tempest, I believe. Yes. 
And Astro Radiance has, um, what did Astro Radiance have? The Aerodactyl and the Machamp, maybe? Not the Aerodactyl, I think. I don't know. I'm sorry. I can't remember. <laughs> I think it had the Machamp, though, the Astral Radiance. Or maybe that was Silver Tempest. No, no. Silver Tempest has a Lugia and something else. Anyways. Well, Lord. Pitalu. Chinchow. Pharaoh Seed. Pikachu. That's a cool-looking Pikachu. Pontia. Ponyta. Ponyta. That's it. Growlithe Reverse. And Talonflame. Not much else there. Put that to the side. Sorry, I know this is making a long video here, but man, we've gotten some really good hits, man. This is a great video. I cannot complain. Now, here comes the ETB. We got that Miriam and that Corridon out of the packs from the sleeved packs. Like, just the random sleeve booster packs from Walmart. That is really unbelievable. I've never had a lot of luck with them. Tandemus, Pokegear 3.0, Floet, Katie... Star Raptor, Electric Generator, Ultra Ball Reverse, Electric Generator again Reverse, and Don Dozo. Yeah, I've never had much luck with the sleeved uh, booster packs from Walmart, but we got Corridon EX, Gold Card, and Miriam, both very well centered. I mean, what more? How much more can you ask for, right? And we still have more. That's not it. I have more sleeved boosters. Uh, more sleeved booster packs to open down the road for you i think we did five on this video i'm gonna do six on another video energy switch for room clauncher skiddo picnic basket bomb birdery hypno shroomish reverse uh, toad school reverse and spite ops ex really cool looking card little spider action there check him out very cool man we're getting some hits man I really, really <laughs> deserve this. I mean, I gotta be honest. Did not get many hits for a good bit of openings. So. Well overdue for these. Man, I hope you enjoy this video. I mean, this is why we do it right here. Please, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. It's free, it's easy, and it really helps out the channel a lot. If you really do like the channel and enjoy watching my videos, please subscribe. You know, it helps out a lot. If you're not going to watch them, though, and, you know, if you don't really care that much, then, yeah, don't bother. But it's very easy. I appreciate the support more than you know. Wug Trio, Judge, Floatzel, oop, Metacham Reverse, Mareep Reverse, and Ndidi. Yeah, I think I'm doing pretty good keeping up on videos, doing Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon. Uh, the quality will get better down the road, but like I said, for now, we're the Backyard Boogie channel. This is a low-budget an iPhone, an iPhone, and some cardboard. That's what that's what my channel should be called. An iPhone and some shiny cardboard. That'd be a good channel name. An iPhone and shiny cardboard. That would definitely be a good channel name. <laughs> Basic Energy, Quoxley, Squovit, Charcadet, Lechonk, Beach Court, Sandaconda, Katie, Katoddle, Starly. And Halucha. Cool looking hollow, but still not, not in love with the <clears throat> with the uh, shiny border. Like the, you know, pretty much copying the Japanese hollows. These packs are a little tough to open, too. They're real tight. At least it seems that way for me, anyways. Basic Energy. Mastiff. Spoopa. Meta. Meditite, Energy Search, Miriam, oh, you gotta love her, right? Lucario, Rock Chest Plate, Smoliv Reverse, Dolliv Reverse, mm, both evolutions there, that's cool. And King, King Gambit, King Gambit, King Gambit or King Gambit, I don't know. You tell me down in the comments below. <laughs> Yeah, these packs, these booster packs seem thick too. Like the plastic they used on these doesn't seem like the old uh, booster packs. It just seems really thick, the plastic. Maybe that's why it seemed hard to open. Starly, Tarantula, mm, Watch Real. Sorry, I was thinking about something. Croca Crocorock, Star Raptor, Electric Generator, Wug Trio. Corridon, that's such a cool, that's such a cool legendary Pokemon. I don't know of it that well. 
I think I remember it on Pokemon Go, but cool reverse, Chansey reverse, and Professor's Research. Just another plain hollow this time. Sorry, my shoulder's messed up from that accident. I'm starting to hurt a little bit there. Got cramped up for a second. We got two packs left after this one, guys. Basic Energy, Grimer, Bruxish, Cackney, Sandow, Sea Titan, Team Star Grunt, Zangoose, Pokeball Reverse, Palmont. That's like Galarian Gallery type thing. Trainer Gallery. Palmont. And Link. Link. Hmm. Link alone. Link alone. It's like cologne. That's how it's spelled. So I'm going to say Link alone. There's a little white spots on the back, but looks pretty good now. Very nice. We got the Link alone. Hey, that's another one we don't have. Always happy to pull uh, decent hits that we do not have. This is a big, big, a big, big, big set. I did not know that this set was like 268 cards, I believe, or something, 200 and some cards. I seen that on a video, someone's YouTube video recently, and I really did not realize it was that big, you know? So, yeah, a lot of, a lot of decent cards in there. You know, a little $5, 10 cards that, you know, we still need to pull, so... Luckily, I bought a lot of this stuff to open for you guys. For all my subscribers, I bought a lot of stuff. I got a lot of stuff stockpiled. Crown Zenith, especially, and Scarlet and Violet. Squawkabilly. Capsa Kid. And a little few things just to throw in here and there. Oh, Alo mm. Alomo. <laughs> Alomo Lala. Alomo Mala. Aloma Mama. Aloma Mama. <laughs> Aloma Mama. Okay, Judge. Sorry, guys. Sorry. Floatzel, man, you're probably thinking this guy is a complete nut. Why am I watching him? Houndour, Sea Viper, Houndstone. Because it's fun, right? We just got two of the best hits, along with a couple other very nice hits. Uh, a very nice uh, double banger pack from um, Astro Radiance, Brawzong, and... The High Soon Samurott V Star. I mean, we got some really, really good hits this one. And of course, the Miriam and Curadon. Last pack, guys. Last pack magic. Let's see. We got that uh, Miriam and Curadon out of a uh, sleeve booster pack that was straight from Walmart. So let's see if we can't get last pack magic and get another Miriam or something crazy. Uh, all our Bisharp, Youngster, Flaffy, Blissey. Rocky Helmet Reverse, Sandow Reverse, and Qua Quavel. No last pack magic, guys, but that was a banger of a video. I hope you enjoyed. If you liked the video and you watched it, I really appreciate it. If, if you enjoyed it a lot, please leave a comment, leave a like, and uh, please subscribe if you're not already. Go through our hits right here. We got the Meridon promo, beautiful card. Iron Treads EX, Brazong, and Hussein Samurott V Star. We got our little promo type cards there. Then we got the biggest banger of them all, the chase card, Miriam. And we got Corridon EX Gold, Spite Ops EX, Oinkalone EX, and Palmont. That's going to do it, guys. I really appreciate you watching. I hope to see you on the next one. Uh, thanks. I'll see you then.